Deftones, Swerve City, Guitar Tabs, and Guitar Lesson. I'll play through all the different sections right at the start here. After that, I'll go back through and explain a little more in detail. Um, before we get into the lesson, please hit the subscription button. Uh, it gives me a really clear indication to know that you enjoy this video and I should do some more like it. And without further wait, let's get on into the video. Alright, so for this one, uh, we're going to need a low B. Alright, so if you have the seven string, you're good to go. You got your low B there. If you're going to do it the uh, Steph Carpenter style, um, if you want to do a six string style, um, I find it easy just to do the low string, drop it all the way down to B, and you can pretty much keep everything else the same. Um, it all works th just fine. It's just we need that one little low B note. So um, it's in the main riff and basically we're going to be here at the third fret and we're just going to hit on that a few times. All right. And then we do this quick three, four, back to three. Then we hit that open low B and then just right back to that third fret. And then we just loop it from there. A verse section we can play just fine in the you know, on the other strings with the standard tuning. So we just got our you know A D G B E strings here, and basically we're just going to start off on this uh, B flat suspended second chord. So just one on the A with the uh, three on the D and G, and then we just bar the the one on the B and E under it. All right, and it's just kind of a loose picking strumming through this, you know. All right. Nothing like super locked in right there. And we just do that for, you know, a measure or two. And then from there, we just change it to a uh, B major seven sus two. So all we're really doing is just taking that, that three on the G and just making it a two. Okay. okay. And it just follows the vocal just slightly right there. So. And the same type of strum and just loose feel to it. All right, so we would just repeat those two chords and then, you know, as we're wrapping up the verse, we get these kind of, um, you know, dead string chugs to like lead us back into the chorus. All right, so you can toss those in there too if you like. With the bridge section, um, we get some use out of that, that low B on this one. Um, basically, we're just going to hit this G minor chord and you can even include that three on the low B with it because it'll just be an octave with what the A is doing, so no big deal. All right, so it's just a big G minor. Okay, just a loose strum through that. And then we do this fun little chromatic scale down here where we come up to eighth fret here. And we just do a slide eight to seven. All right, and then we keep it going. We go seven to six. And then, you know, five to four. All right, so it's just kind of like this stuttering, like jolting, descending chromatic thing there. So it's just more about kind of getting the timing on it. Right, and it just 
leads us right back into our G minor. All right, we just crank through that a few times for the bridge. All right, then we get a cool little, you know, solo thing at uh, after the bridge, and it just comes up, and we're going high now on the uh, E string here. We come all the way up to 17. All right, hold that for a few beats, and then land on 15 of the B. Then we take our 17 E down to 13. Hold that for about a count or so, and then bring it back up to the 15. And we just loop that. 